Hey guys, what's up? Pasay Baller here. We are now in this second game for today, February 15, 2023. We are now in this game between Chicago Bulls and Indiana Pacers. The game will happen at 7 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time, so that's going to be 8 o'clock a.m. here in Manila. I'm just inviting everyone who have not subscribed yet to our YouTube account or YouTube channel, Pasay Baller. Please click on the subscribe button below. At the same time, hit on that bell logo. That way, automatically, you guys will be receiving notifications whenever new videos are uploaded. The spread, by the way, that is given is minus 2.5, and that's actually given towards the home team, Indiana Pacers. Now, let's take a look at the... Uh, standings and the rankings of both teams, both belonging to the Eastern Conference. For Chicago Bulls, they are at number 11 with a record of 26 wins and 31 losses, while right behind them is Indiana Pacers at number 12 with a record of 25 and 34. Okay, so here we go. Um, Indiana Pacers, they would have the home court advantage on this. In terms of, um, in terms of fatigue, well, both teams had their rest last night, so we can skip that part. In terms of momentum, man, both teams are have been losing. Um, approaching this game, uh, the Bulls, they are on a four-game losing slump, while the Pacers, they are on a five-game losing slump. Now, checking on their forms, the Chicago Bulls, they have won uh, four out of their last ten, while the Pacers, they have only won once out of their last ten games. Um, this is a bit tough, but uh, I got to give a slight advantage towards Chicago Bulls considering the form that they have. Now let's take a look at the availability and the health of both teams. Okay, now for Chicago Bulls, man, they are banged up. Um, I can see Lonzo Ball, DeMar DeRozan, Javante Green, and Derek Jones Jr. all confirmed out for this game. While we have Goran Dragic and Alex Caruso both listed as questionable. So we have four players out for the Bulls and a couple of players listed as questionable. Now for Indiana Pacers, they are looking healthier, um, uh, only having da uh, Daniel Thais and Miles Turner um, listed as questionable for this game. So obviously, the Indiana Pacers would have uh, the advantage in terms of health as they only have a couple of players listed down here. Um, this, is, this is really tough. I mean, this is almost um, a toss coin. I mean, obviously, Indiana Pacers got... Uh, some advantages coming on to this game. Number one is, uh, of course, the home court that they have. Number two, they are the healthier team. As mentioned earlier, DeMar DeRozan is out. Alex Caruso is listed as questionable. Um, Derek Jones is out for the Bulls. So, um, again, the Pacers, they are the healthier team. Uh, plus the fact that uh, Miles Turner and uh, Daniel Thais, two of their bigs, are just listed as questionable. They still have... Uh, the chance to actually to actually suit up and play for this game, so um, those are the you know those are the angles we're in. You can consider Indiana Pacers as the winner on this game, but for Chicago Bulls, um, you can take a look at it and actually uh, tell yourself and hey, hey, you know what, Demar Derozan may be out, but Zach Levine is there, right? Um, uh, White is there, Vucevic is there, so they still have a lot of weapons out there. Um, plus the form that they have, I know it's not that good winning four out of their last 10, but that's way better than the Indiana Pacers' form, winning just one out of their last 10. So, just like what I said earlier, it could be a toss coin. Either team can actually beat the other. Um, and this is re really going to be tough, but I'm going to pick Chicago Bulls in here. I'm going to pick Chicago Bulls plus the spread given to them, which is 2.5. Um, I feel like, just like what I said earlier, they have enough weapons left uh, on their team. Uh, Zach Levine and uh, Vucevic, um, they have enough firepower to at least keep it close. Now, for Indiana Pacers, in any case, Miles Turner won't be there. That should be a big trouble for them as Vucevic is really now turning into an offensive weapon for the Bulls. Again, my pick would be Chicago plus 2.5. Bulls plus 2.5. Peace out. Pass I love and God bless.